And now, it's time for another Dice Tower Review with Tom Vassell. Today we're talking about Flickin' Chicken, which is a box that comes with four rubber chickens and a Frisbee style scoring disc. It's from Haywire Group and it's not necessarily a game as almost as it is a sports activity, although what's the difference? Where does game begin and sports begin? Who knows? But anyhow, let's take a look at this game, Flickin' Chicken. The contents of Flicking Chicken are right here. You can see there's a bunch of rubber chickens, and then we have basically a Frisbee here, which has a plus one penalty on one side and a minus one on the other side. So each player gets a chicken, and the game will begin. At the beginning of the game, one player throws the Frisbee as far as they can, hopefully so it doesn't go in another yard. Then each player is gonna come and start at a point, and they're gonna take turns trying to throw their chickens at the point. So one player throws their chicken first, you can throw it or launch it. Okay, get it caught in the tree. And then, hey dogs, don't ruin the game. Put the chicken down. Put the chicken down. Hang on. Put, don't touch the chicken. All right, after each player has thrown their chickens, they will then pick up their chicken from where they're at, and they're still trying to throw it at the thing. Each throw counts as one point. And they're trying to hit the target and make their chicken land on the target. It's kind of like miniature golf. So go ahead and make the second throws, everyone. Okay, hey, will you stop grabbing the chicken? This dog is ruining the game. All right. So try to get it on the thing. Okay, now, if you land on the thing, you count the number of throws. So in this one, everyone threw three times. Now, the dog interfered, so this one had land here. But if anyone had landed on the bonus, then that person would have got minus one to their throw. Just like on the other side, when you flip it to the other side, you'll see that the penalty of plus one, that will make your plus throw. So you want to hit the disc, but you don't want to hit the disc in the middle. And I could pretend that there's a whole lot more to the game than this, but that's pretty much all there is. You just keep throwing, then you throw the first beat from here, and you can play a whole nine holes of golf, or nine holes of flicking chicken golf, or whatever you want to call it. And whoever has the lowest score is the winner. All right, let's take a real quick rundown through the kids to see what they think of Flickin' Chicken. Do you like this game? You like throwing the chicken? Yep. Anything else you want to say? Nope. All right, next. <laughs> what do you think? I like it because I like the chickens and you can throw the frisbee. And the chickens are different colors. All right. I like the white ones. All right. Next. What do you think of this game? I like this game trying to throw the chickens at the frisbee disc and um, trying to make it land on the outside or in the inside compared to which side it landed on or what they put it on. Um, and I really like the way the chickens were. Yeah, well, the rubber chickens. I mean, so I suppose that's one reason to buy the game in and of itself. I. I, I mean, we really can't go into any in-depth analysis. You're throwing the frisbee and then you're trying to throw the chicken. I actually like the plus one penalty side better because I like the fact that you're trying to hit the frisbee but not trying to hit it so much that it goes into the middle. But everything here is pretty good quality. Melody and I played this at a convention center around games. It's, it's silliness, it's funniness. I don't know about the longevity of it, but it is what it is. It's the, you know, the games tells you it's flick and chicken and that's that. So until next time, I'm Tom Vassell. And you've been watching Flickin' Chicken. Thanks so much for watching the Dice Tower videos. 
Find more great videos and reviews, as well as our top-rated audio podcast at Dicetower.com. You can also find the latest board game news at Dicetowernews.com. I'm Eric Summerer, and you've been watching The Dice Tower. The Dice Tower is sponsored by Fun Again Games, the world's best game source. Fun Again Games has over 5,000 games available. Check them out at funagain.com.